You know, we tend to go Italian on Thursdays here in Low Country Live, and you've seen La Fontana right here in our kitchen in recent weeks, but today we're in one of their kitchens, and our John Bruce is there right now at the West Ashley location. Hey, John. Jessica, good morning to you once again, coming to you live from the kitchen. This is where the magic happens at La Fontana on Savannah Highway in West Ashley. we got Chef Gary once again for us, my good doing? friend. Chef, how are you today? Doing wonderful. Doing man. well. What are we making? I know we got a good today treat. Today we got out. a nice uh, Villefranchise we're making with uh, asparagus and lemon butter sauce. That sounds good to me. Let's okay, get right into it. What's the first right step? First step is getting oil nice and hot. Okay. Okay, we got some nice pounded veal. Chef, tell me about this veal. We talked a little about it last time, but uh, tell me that the trick to pounding that veal, making sure it's tender. Well, and good. you just de definitely got to pound it out for a long time. Make sure it's nice and thin. So you can cut it with a fork like you can do at La Fontana. You say you want to see through it, right? You want That's to the see key. Through it. That's the key. It's a good looking piece of meat right there. We're gonna put that in, get a little sizzle going. Chef, tell me about some of the other great menu items here, La Fontana, because you guys do all the classics and everything tastes so so good. Yeah, we got um, a lot of uh, veal. You know, m mainly we all veal dishes and uh, seafood, pizzas, calzones, stromboli's. Uh, a lot of our items are uh, everything we make in house. To go ahead and uh, we love La Fontana, especially the lunch special. Tell us about that. Six ninety nine, so many great items. Six ninety nine, anything on the menu, any dish on the menu, six ninety nine, only at La Fontana. Chef, I know you put a lot of you put a lot of garlic in there. You got some, was that parsley you threw in there too? Or we basically? got a little bit of parsley, salt and pepper for right now. I'm gonna saute it up and let the go ahead and let the cook the garlic cook up a little bit. I'm gonna add just a little. Uh, Nice squeeze of lemon. Yeah, a little fresh lemon in there, a little scent, a little flavor as well. Okay. And tell us about that catering, because you guys could do this on a grand scale. You, you catered our party the other day at Channel 4. Everything tasted so delicious. Wonderful. Tell us about how you can help people out on a large scale. Well, as well. we do, you know, weddings, uh, any, any office catering, any type of catering that you need, we can accommodate you. Just, you know, send us an email or give us a call. We'd love to be, be part of your party. Indeed. And you do lunch, you do dinner as well. And yes. you got a great wine selection. You Absolutely. got a full bar. Everything you need for a great restaurant. Everything you need for a great restaurant. We got two locations, North Charleston, West Ashley. I mean, we could try to accommodate the whole low country. We appreciate that. And tell us where you got your recipes, because you told me last time you're born and raised in Italy. So you've been doing this your whole life. Yeah, I grew up in Italy. My mother owned the restaurant for uh, 12 years. And so um, we, um, you know, basically most of all my family grew up in the restaurant business in Italy, in so Naples. These are recipes these are all recipes passed down, passed generation down to generation. generation. Absolutely. We like that as well. How's our veal coming? Tell me about our that. Our veal's great. Um, John, I think we're going to go ahead and turn up the heat a little bit. All right. If you want to grab some of Put uh, me to work, Chef. I appreciate that. What are we doing here? Put a little wine in there. Oh, look at that. Turn it up, turn up the heat on Channel 4. I like that. So that's going to give it a good, nice little sear to it as well. Yeah, it's going to go ahead and deglaze it down on the pan. That looks delicious. Chef, let's take a look at some of the other great menu items that you got here at La Fontana. Starting off with this delicious stromboli. You got everything in there. That's like the kitchen sink. Well, we like to fill it up. We like to make sure that everybody's happy and you get definitely the value for uh, your money. And tell me about this dish right here, because this, this right looks here is fantastic. This right here is the fruit seafood. Uh, it's got, you know, clams, mussels, uh, fresh shrimp, uh, calamari. It's wonderful. And this is going to be our... Uh, our dish of the day. So we need right a little here. more lemon in our veal right there. A little more lemon. We're going to top it off with our fresh asparagus locally. And this is going to be. You just put the sauce right on Sauce it. right on it. And that's it. We love that. It's so fantastic. What time are you guys open for lunch? We open for lunch at 1130 every day from, uh, we pretty much stay open all day. We don't close. So, uh, but you know, we go all the way until three o'clock for lunch and from three to 10, it's a dinner time. And the best part, value, affordability, Ability. delicious, delicious food. Yes, absolutely. All right, fantastic. Chef Gary, thank you so much for your time. We appreciate thank having you, us John. back here. I think I look great, Tessa, definitely. They put me to work here. Now, the best part, we're going to eat some of this stuff. I suggest you come here on the Savannah location or the North Charleston location and do that as well. Chef Gary, great job as always, Thank my you, friend. thank you. Let's get into it. Tessa, we're going to send it back to you. All right, John, looking good, and I'm sure smelling good. We're all like licking the TV screens here looking at that. Well, here it's to your health. Just ahead on Low Country Live, you're invited to a special wellness event at MUSC's East Cooper Campus. And it's time to celebrate the fall season at the annual Harvest Fest on John's Island. Details are straight ahead.